What's up guys this is Ronnie welcome back to our channel total technology this is tutorial 16 and today's topic will be some exercise on numpy masking in the last tutorial i have already discussed what is masking and we did some sort of simple examples but i mentioned that this is going to be very uh, important things cause often within your data science um, like project or while you are doing some cleanup or while you are building your data set for training and test you you need to do some sort of like uh, checking or condition based on uh, your requirement for example you want to do some sort of sampling cause your data set varies between um, like a very small range to very uh, like very small to very large uh, like i'm just uh, using a very bad terms but if i use actual term it will be difficult for you guys to understand for example your data varies between um, 0 0.001 to uh, 1 million some values and you want to do some sort of sampling based on that uh, 100 or 1000 within that range so what you want to do whenever your values um, is greater than 10000 you want to uh, divide it, that value after uh, with 100 so that uh, everything should, should be some sort of like uh, uniform you are not having uh, like uh, uh, like um, any um, uh, difference between your data for training set or uh, like um, test set so for those sort of things this uh, masking is going to be very unique and for that actually i designed to exercise and this is going to be a uh, very unique exercise and if you guys understand this thing then you can do many things like using this thing not only on data science you like in 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 case of you are writing some sort of like uh, scripting or any other python uh, programming that there also you should use this sort of things and your performance will be increased okay so what is the first exercise so first exercise is that um, set zero on the below numpy array where elements uh, again i did a typo where um okay set zero uh on the below numpy array where elements are completely divisible by three for example this is your input array and you have to set zero in the location where the elements are completely divisible by three for example this is completely divisible by uh, three so it will become zero the objective is that to make it zero this is also divisible by three so you have to make it zero this is nine is also completely divisible by three so it will also become zero this is also become zero 12 is definitely you can divide 12 by three then this 15 also will be become zero then 18 and 21 so you have to convert uh, all this integer from their corresponding number to zero cause they are already uh, as per the condition they are divisible by three so how to do that so for doing that you should use uh, numpy um, masking tricks and this will actually going to help you i have created this tutorial so first thing first import numpy as np okay so like this and let's create the array first okay so first let me give one exercise one so it is going to be uh, let me see so it starts with zero and it ends with 23 so it will be arrange we have to use we can use arrange and 24 and let me check so four rows six columns so we, we can use reshape actually so now you guys understand like why i did this tutorial reshape and other things at the beginning because this is very useful so four rows six column okay so if you so I got this thing so now my requirement is to uh, change this thing um, like this is zero 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 and this is zero so how to achieve that for first thing first we have to create the mask actually so it should be divisible by three zero okay so if you put this thing so I get only this element so uh, uh, element 0 3 and where this is actually uh, completely divisible and there actually it is going to be double right uh, no, sorry going to be 0 okay so 0 is already 0 so there is no need to change so that is why so 3 will be changed to 0 3 6 9 12 15 18 21 so 3 6 9 12 15 18 
and 21 will be changed and for doing this change you have to do very simple thing uh, let me explain you so this is the thing then you have to assign okay and what you have to assign you have to assign zero that's it so if you run this thing that uh, and after that if you check this array you will see that it is got it got changed okay so let's uh, run this thing now see three got changed to zero three changed to zero six also changed to zero six uh, below six it is 12 12 is also changed to zero below 12 it is 18 18 also changed to zero so just below three we have nine so below three we have nine is also changed nine after nine we uh, below nine we have 15 15 also changed to 0 0 say 0 and 15 uh, be just below 15 we have 21 21 is also like changed to 0 okay so this is how it is this is very simple guys but this is the actual thing okay so uh, getting the mask then applying the mask on the spacey speak location okay so that's it guys so this is very useful so what i'll do just take a screenshot of this thing let me but don't worry uh, i will also upload the github repository okay not sure what happened okay I need to insert this thing from here actually okay okay so mm, fine let me make it a bit bigger hopefully you guys, you guys will be able to understand yeah it's fine but don't worry i'll also upload this into github as well okay so next thing uh, we have another exercise so next exercise is set element into two for every location where the element is completely divisible by three so condition is same but the uh, the value will be uh, different this time so what it means element into two for example initially in the first exercise we are setting zero for every element now you want to set element into two for example three is completely divisible by three it uh, so the requ requirement is whenever uh, the element is completely divisible by three make that element double so three will become six six will become 12 nine will become 18 12 will become 24 15 will become 30 18 will become 36 and 21 become uh, will become 42 so see the requirement is that we know zero is also divisible but zero if I, whatever you multiply with zero it will be zero so there is no point so see uh, six will become uh, three will become six uh, 12 actually this this is the output so 12 here then 9 became uh, 18 uh, then 12 became uh, 24 then 15 is uh, converted to 30 then 18 is 36 and 21 is 42 so this is the next requirement so how to do that we'll be see we'll, we'll be we'll be uh we'll be going to uh, perform this in the next uh, tutorial so next tutorial means in the next uh, now only okay so let me open my id okay so tutorial two so same thing uh, i need to again um, create and an this thing again okay, let me just uh, create a new array exercise two b equals to np dot range same thing 24 and uh, we'll apply reshape okay it will be four and six okay so b like this now the requirement is to uh, change this thing so what i'll do i'll just do this thing okay so here the actual magic will happen so what is expected that the element into two so how to get that element for this element so we have to again pass the mask over here right 
so it will be a 3 0 and it is required requirement is that so if I do this thing we will get the resultant element for this location only right and we have to just multiply with 2 okay this is the same thing so understand so if you do this thing we will get the mask uh, in this locations right and get the elements right so this is actually going to return the element so now what I am doing I am just setting uh, this element values uh, I am actually going to change this element value with this mask into 2 okay so this the applying this mask means will be going to return 3 6 9 12 15 18 21 and after that I am just multiply every element into 2 and after that I am setting the value to this mask this mask is actually means this locations okay so if I do this thing see Scott completely changed now we'll see whether it is changed or not okay fine so you see here uh, uh, the requirement is to make it uh, okay actually I did a mistake uh, I converted I created the array with name B but I used here a so that is why it is giving wrong answer but don't worry guys so it happens sometimes that is why I create a new array b3 so let's do it okay and let's run this thing again okay again i put a here sorry guys so see 3 become 16 uh, 6 uh, 6 become 12 9 become 18 12 become 24 15 become 30 18 become 36 80 and 21 become 40 so so the expected result right so again let me uh, explain this thing one more time so we got the mask from here we applied the mask to get the elements and after that we am setting again the same element into two here from the right hand side okay so this is very useful and i'm just giving you one more uh, use case that you guys can uh, try again um, like if you have uh, like uh, completely understood uh, the concept then you guys can um, try this thing or else I, I will try to do it in the next tutorial so often in your uh, like um, program normal program just forget about uh, python uh, data science or other thing you often have a requirement that uh, uh, you have a multiple um, uh, excel files and from the excel files wherever the string um, value contains um, xyz and you want to uh, change it to abc and for doing this thing probably we will we'll be going to run some sort of uh, what do you say some sort of for looping but if you do if you avoid this for looping and if you apply numpy thing like what you have to do you have to load the text file using uh, gen from text like np.gen from text you can load the text file and all val values of the csp will be loaded as a uh, numpy columns uh, like as an every element as a string value and after that you can apply easily this thing so it will become that element equals to equals to xyz equals to uh, some value abc so you will see within a fraction of a second you will depending on your data maybe your data is 1 million definitely it will not take fraction of a second probably it will take uh, 2 second or 3 second but the performance will be exponentially improved if you are using normal for loop or this numpy thing so that is why this is very powerful thing this masking so you guys uh, must apply this thing whenever possible try to apply this thing and definitely you will be you will actually um, improve as a programmer you will uh, improve your coding standards and also you'll become more much more mature and you will start thinking from the design uh, or the cpu utilization and performance point of view and definitely this will help you to become a good programmer in the future that is that is the ultimate thing right okay guys so enough of talking so let me oh sorry uh, so let me just what is happening i'm not sure I'm trying to take a screenshot but this is not happening here okay okay now this will work okay so let me put the solution here but I'll upload the notebook as well okay
ओके ओके फाइन सो दैट्स इट गाइस मे बी विल डू वन मोर एक्सरसाइज इन द नेक्स्ट ट्यूटोरियल बट दैट इन दैट एक्सरसाइज आई बी गोइंग टू सम सी एस वी फाइल वट एवर आई जस्ट डिस्कस बट गाइज ट्राई टू डू सम सॉर्ट ऑफ प्रैक्टिस और राइट राइट योर ओन कोड बिल्ड अप योर ओन यूज केसेस कम अप विथ योर सोल्यूशन इफ यू हैव एनी डिफिकल्टीज यू कैन आस्क मी आई ट्राई टू इंक्लूड ऑल दोज यूज केसेज इफ इट इज डिफिकल्ट टू एक्सप्लेन इन द ई मेल और समथिंग आई विल ट्राई टू इंक्लूड ऑल दिस थिंग्स बट ट्राई टू डू सम सॉर्ट ऑफ प्रैक्टिस अंटिल एंड अनलेस यू आर नॉट डूइंग योर ओन प्रैक्टिस इट इज नॉट गोइंग टू हेल्प यू ओके So that's it guys we'll see you in the next video till then take care goodbye and don't forget to subscribe our channel hit the like button if you are really enjoying the videos put some comments uh, with your feedback and last but not least thank you very much for all the udemy students for purchasing this course it is actually helping me a lot and same thing is applicable for all of you whenever in doubt or need any clarification please feel free to ask me over udemy i will try to answer all of your queries within like within the timeline okay so that's it we'll see you in the next video till then take care goodbye and happy learning